rainbow vessels riding gentle waves. Wow, look at that. Look at the depth of field. Kamosta, mabuhay, magandang gabi, and welcome back to MG and Diego. I was Sio Vela, and yes, of course, today I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be doing part two of the Wake Up in the Philippines Philippines Tourism Ads 2020 video. Of course, because you guys showed me that you care. You know, you are liking the video, you are commenting below. You are telling me that you want to see part two, so of course I was gonna do it, but it's not just that, it's because I'm interested as well. The first part was amazing. I mean, those landscapes are to die for, like legit. So I read some of your comments and it's beautiful to see how much uh, not only do you love your country, but also how much you've learned from this uh, reaction video. You know, some of you are like, Oh my God, I live in that place that they showed in the video and I did not know that uh, there were so many things in it, you know? You guys told me that, it's a fun fact, also a, uh, a true fact apparently, that there is one island that disappears and reappears with the tides, you know, of the ocean. So basically, when the waters uh, rise, the island disappears, and when the waters go down, the island reappears. So the number of Filipino islands fluctuate. How cool of a fact is that? You know what I mean? Now, I'm wondering how big this island is. It's probably a very tiny one, but it would be cool, you know, to visit that island and be like, hey, I've been to that island that disappears and reappears, you know, according to the uh, the tides of the, the ocean or whatever, you know? That is so freaking cool. And in that video, I also mentioned that there was a shot of two, uh, two people on like uh, motorbikes or something and behind them, there was a, uh, a, a, uh, a mount, you know? like a, a big, big mountain. And that shot looked so incredible that I said that could be fake, you know? But I mean, I didn't believe it was, but you guys actually confirmed that that was true, man. Can you believe that? It's amazing, it's amazing. And then you also confirmed in the comment section below that uh, tourism is open to local people, not to uh, tourists, foreign tourists. So we're still gonna have to wait. And guys, I am not kidding, because some of you are like, oh, I hope you meant it when you said that you wanna come. Bro, I've been planning, I am serious. My brother and I were planning to come uh, was it April 2020 and then COVID happened actually it was my brother who contacted me and he was like yo have you heard of this pandemic thing uh, maybe we should wait you know before we go to the Philippines and I was like nah we, we, we should go we should go and then a week later things got even worse and we were like yeah we're gonna have to postpone the trip so Trust me, as soon as things, you know, go back to normal, bam, my first destination is the Philippines. That's for damn sure, okay? So anyway, uh, we, <laughs> we are here today to react to part two. Uh, but before we start, please consider following me on Instagram at Music Game News. And you know, when I go to the Philippines, that's where I'll be uh, posting all the pictures that I take in the Philippines for sure. Anywho, uh, without further ado, let's continue. Every day I wake up to a feast. Western Visayas. Oh my god. Oh, did you see that shot? So apparently Filipinos love their fried food and they love to cook with pork. Where I can sink my teeth into history. So, do you guys have a lot of ruins? You know, because I like to visit ruins. That's why I also want to go to Italy. Shock my taste buds with something new. It's here I learned the color of sweetness. 
And by the way, guys, one of my favorite fruit is mango, and you guys have the best mangoes, so. Expanded my pantry. Wow. <laughs> and my appetite. Oh, wow, pastries. But see how well shot these ads are. They make everything look super attractive. Super appealing. Every next bite only leaves you Yummy. Nom, 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 nom. Wake up in Aklan, Antique, Capiz, Guimaras, Iloilo, Negros, Occidental. There you go. 7,641, but apparently it's also 7,642, you know, depending on the tides. Today, I woke up below the surface. See, I'd like to do this, you know, I'd like to go deep diving, but I am scared of uh, big fish. So, we'll see, we'll see how courageous I can be where I learned to face my feet. Oh my God, sharks. Exactly, learn how to, to uh, face your fears, bro. But it's when I came to appreciate the big... See, that gives me chills. Just watching that gives me chills. Because it's beautiful, but because it's scary. Wow. Can you imagine the feeling of what just happened? Swimming amongst all those like what? 500 fish at the same time moving like that, you know, in synchronous in synchrony in in harmony. Made new friends from all over and could no longer hide my true colors that I knew I'd emerged a local. You know, maybe maybe this is why uh, Filipinos are such beautiful and kind-hearted people who are always smiling, even though um, you know a lot of them don't have the means to to live a you know a comfortable life. Maybe it's because of where they're living, you know, as well because of the beautiful landscapes, you know, like the 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 quality of life there. Maybe that's why. Bohol, oh. Are those the, they call them the chocolate mountains or something like that? Wow. I woke up to worlds unknown. Where water is stronger than rock. So I learned to sit back and enjoy the ride. Get washed up on a deserted island. <laughs> Explore the locals' living history. She's beautiful. Whoa, did you see that? A bridge. I think it was a bridge. Perhaps even find a hole in the wall. Or discover a whole new world to be on top of. Wow. Man. Today I woke up inside a kaleidoscope. A kaleidoscope? Hey, she's oh my god, she's so cute and beautiful. Surrounded by mesmerizing patterns. Vibrant shades. Yum, 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 yum. Golden colors. Mm. We taste. Stop it. You're making me hungry now. I just ate breakfast, but I'm hungry again. Oh. An endless stretch. Wow. Oh my god. I want to pause every time because they all the images look like wallpapers that you can put on your phone or on your computer you know powdery pink sand 
rainbow vessels riding gentle waves. Wow, look at that. Look, and the depth of field, and the purplish pink color, you know, uh, marrying the sun, you know, the brightness of the sun. <gasps> A technicolor dream just bursting at the seams. With ever changing views and views. But no fail, always a whole lot of fun. Wow. Today, I woke up on Northern Mindanao. Wild ride. Woo! Right in the middle of a river. It takes me to some pretty unexpected drops. I rode a bunch of highs and lows. I screamed at the top of my lungs. See, I'm not that kind of tourist. I'm not the kind of tourist that goes and risk their lives, you know. I mean, I, sure, you know, it, it must be fun, you know, like the adrenaline and everything, but it's still very risky, you know. I might do one or two activities, but bro, jumping from a uh, an airplane or something like that, hell no. Zip lining is fine. Just when I thought Wow, look at that. Look how tiny that island is. Maybe that's the island I was talking about. <laughs> it was over. There was another thrill waiting around the corner. And for however long I stay for the ride. Always an adventure. Wow. Every day I wake suck suck what sucks sargon cup in a sea of green. Sargon. A place where everything Sox grows. Sargon. Even dreams that weave themselves into our style and art. Into our, our style and art. Here the land is rich and healthy. Locals, yeah. And always happy to give. These commercials remind me a lot of the ABS-CBN commercials. People here are connected to the land. And everywhere you look. Wow, look at the close-ups of uh, food and fruits. I wake up at a postcard Every single day. Yeah, man. Hmm. Wow. Ugh. That shot of those islands like that, it just makes you want to go in an adventure. Wow, look at that. Look at the uh, the trees. Each corner a love letter straight from cloud nine. Scribbled reminders to soak up the sun. Everywhere's an invitation to come over. The warmth I find nowhere else that makes me stay. Siargao. All right, I think we're done. This is like the uh, summary of all the ads. Yeah. Wow. The 
Philippines. There you go. That's the shot. The mountain. You know, I think I might rewatch this uh, video, the entire thing on my TV because I think it's more impressive to watch these beautiful images on a big screen, you know? It's so freaking gorgeous, actually hard to believe that a place like this actually exists, you know? My cousin went to Thailand and told me that Thailand as well is just to die for and that the people there also are very nice. So, my God, man. And he wanted to go back to Thailand this year, but of course, the pandemic. So, boom, no one can, uh, can do anything, unfortunately. Mind-blowing, mind-blowing. Of course, you know, there is the other side of the Philippines, okay? So the Philippines, yes, it is beautiful, it is gorgeous, it is welcoming and everything. But there is also the, uh, I guess, less attractive side, right? That I do not forget and that I saw in multiple videos, you know? So you have to take the good with the bad and that's fine. And if people can help, you know, then that's, that's what they should do. You know, you, you can't just take, you also have to give. Um, this was just fantastic. I loved it. I loved it. I loved it. You know, I had so much fun watching this. If you have any more suggestions of uh, videos like this, let me know. But, you know, if it's from a vlogger that's just gonna film himself and talk and talk and talk and talk over the video, then, nah, I'm not very interested in that. Like, what's his name? Uh, Matt Le... No, what's it? Something Leblanc right leblanc he's canadian and everything he has so many videos about the philippines you know like yes he did a fantastic job and like his videos are beautiful but at some point when all the vloggers do the same thing i get tired of it you know so i prefer just watching something that's beautifully shot like this one um so yeah let me know in the comment section below by liking the video by sharing the video uh maraming maraming salamat po thank you so much for joining me it was a blast uh discovering these parts of the philippines with you you know man it will happen it will happen uh, i have uh, faith uh and uh yeah take care of yourselves have a good day stay safe and i will see you in the next video as usual peace Thank you for watching, subscribe here and please like the video to show your support and appreciation for my work and turn on the notification bell to be poked for future content. Yeah, yeah, yeah.